Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. 你现在他妈的，你这种将军就是你搞出来的，这样的体制，你他妈的，现在跟我讲我们没有实力，我们很弱小，弱小，你全家都弱小，干你老鸡掰的，拖你死一百遍都不够，拖你枪毙一百次都不够，王八蛋，他妈的！是仍然是一个执政者，不要挑衅，不要轻起战端。我们毕竟是弱者，这是一个很现实的问题。All right, so here he is, really, for my money, as accomplished a submission specialist and Brazilian jiu-jitsu practitioner as has crossed into the UFC in years. We'll see how quickly tonight he can get this fight to the ground and utilize his high-level submission skills. Outstanding choke game. A lot of different chokes in his repertoire. We'll see if he can get him going tonight. This guy is a world-class Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu specialist. His chokes, his arm bars, his leg locks, everything is world-class. And if the fight goes to the ground, he will have a distinct advantage. Fill the tape for this heavyweight fight. More than five years apart, and they both possess a similar height and reach. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon, Eva Lavey. Is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 254 pounds. Fighting an obvious Samoa, Big. And now we his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Running out of Beijing, China, Dollar Bill. Okay, could take yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's about to go down right now. And we are underway at the Met of Madison Square Garden in New York City. Nice one-two there. I right, check that leg kick, Joe. Oh, tagged him. Trying to kick the leg out. Wow, what a powerful leg kick that was. Tags him. And they are exchanging leather early. He got tagged there. This is a, this is a bit of a chest battle here. Well, he eats a punch to the head there, Joe, and he would be wild. 
tries to get his head off of that center line. It's almost as if he's moving straight into that punch. That one hurt. And he's looking for that left. Back to the straight punch here, Joe. It's good. Start to see some of the damage cut underneath that right eye. Good <laughs> yeah, out, nice. Vicious uppercut. Hard left hand. Both guys landing in a pretty decent clip. Oh! Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. Not there. He clipped him. out, nice. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Oh! He's got good accuracy on that jab. That knee might have landed there. Struggling for position in the clinch. Looks like he's looking to dive under for the knee bar, and he does! There's a lot of pressure on that leg, and it's getting worse. He might have to tap. Incredible! And there it is! absolutely incredible! It was a beautiful job setting up that submission, and once he got it, the fight was over. Yeah, that is high-level stuff out of him there, Joe, to finish the submission. It's one thing to get the dominant position. It's another thing to close the show, and he certainly did that here tonight. That's a big one. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And one more time, Nice technique here on this submission. So a seminal moment for this fighter here tonight as he gets the win by submission. Huge victory in his career. And it'll be very interesting to see how they match make him moving forward. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve LeBing has called a stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 57 seconds of the very first round. To play the winner by tap out. So there he is, your winner by way of submission, and how good was that? I mean, you talk about maximizing a UFC showcase, and that's a great example of doing just that. You see him sharing a moment here with his coaches, his training partners, and you can be sure that with the hard work done and the hay in the barn, that these guys are going to be celebrating deep into the night. If you like this video, click right here to subscribe. Or right here, or right here, or right here. Just subscribe, dummy.